and welcome to our kitchen. We actually asked you guys what you want to see on winter sessions in the last video and someone was like, do a cook with us. And I was like, we actually wanted to do this last year. We, did. we, we wanted, wanted to cook last year, year, but we were both in the, the situations were not cute. So now we at least have like an actual Space, nice variety. kitchen. <laughs> so we're going to be making a winter inspired meal, which what else could it be but pasta? 10 out of 10 content. You need carbs in winter, guys. Yo, to give you a hug. When no one else will. Which is so bad because like straight after it's summer. So now what? Every now and again. <laughs> you know, it's thing every day. Yeah. So we're making Alfredo pasta bake. I literally googled the recipe on Google. So <laughs> I will link it down below. But I feel like for the most part, I'm just... We're just going to wing it. We're going to wing it. We just need Good a taste. Guys. Yes. Thank you. Yes. Pasta. This is penne. Because I feel like it's, it's important to eat in it. It's nicer as, yeah. a, as like a bake. I've got some chicken that was already like stir fried. Cheese. We have two types of cheese mozzarella and white cheddar. You I can obviously use whatever cheese yeah. you want. Yeah. The vegetables, onions, which is just it's like. Standard procedure for any. You can't thing. start cooking without onions. That's weird. We got the broccoli and cauliflower mix. This isn't in the recipe, but we just wanted to add, add some vegetables. greeneries. Yeah. And everything else you'll see as we go, it's like the normal cooking stuff. Like, oh, I forgot. White sauce packets. Because we're not going to make it from scratch with flour. Why bother? This is 15 random pack, guys. Come on. No one has that. <laughs> no one has that. Imagine having tongue of flour. And then, as I was saying, everything else is just pretty much what you cook with. So, like, your spices, garlic, garlic butter, butter, butter oil. oil. You know, like, you know, we are now flipped to inside our kitchen, and right now we're boiling the water to make the pasta. We have to pre make the pasta kind of because we don't want to put hot shells into the oven because then it's not going to cook and then and you're just going to have crusty, <laughs> crusty, crusty pasta. <laughs> it's going to go hard. Yeah. Like harder because the water is what makes it soft. Exactly. So we are doing that right now with and putting. Um, so in the water, you put oil and salt so that the pasta doesn't But not stick. a lot. It's a touch of oil. Yeah. Like it's a teaspoon touch. and then like a, a dash. What do they call it? Yeah. Sprinkle. Pinch. Pinch. A pinch of salt. <laughs> I don't know. We both did this. I don't know why yo. she's dashing salt. Also, I will say that with this type of situation, you don't want to cook it too close to it being like perfect. Because of the fact that we're still going to put it in the oven. So it doesn't need to actually be al dente, to be really honest with you. It yes. can be just before. And then... Yes! <laughs> I'm on my mood! The Zama in its natural habitat. Cutting Guys, the onion. This is so far from my natural habitat. It's a joke. This is not my portion in life. Look at me! Okay, guys. Love that! Sizzle, sizzle, honey. Sizzle, sizzle. And garlic. Okay, that's ah. Uh, that was so drugs. Okay, a little more. This is really essential, guys, for the taste. Yo, garlic is in me. In a bizarre. Chicken spice. Most of the time at this stage of the game, people put curry powder. We don't eat hot food, so that's why I'm putting chicken spice. She's going to taste the... What's this? The pasta. pasta. <laughs> What are the boys saying? We're gonna leave it in for like one more minute and then it's gonna be fine to put in the, in the oven. Okay. Yeah. Okay guys, we're now gonna be dropping the chicken in. Chicken, chicken in. is already, <laughs> the chicken in, the chicken is already cut as you guys can see. I recommend that you get everything cut because I ain't about the chopping life. I'm sure you aren't either. So the quicker you can do things, the better. We're adding more flavor. Chicken spice. So more chicken spice. Oh, and soy sauce. Okay. <laughs> We've been boiling milk because milk makes it creamier instead of water. Like this thing says use water, but use milk. We are nice rebels stuff. like that. <laughs> we don't follow the rules. <laughs> Yo, who's <his> little brother? <laughs> um, yeah, Azish. And then you stir vigorously so that it doesn't make balls. Balls. 
hey. If it's lumpy, you there we use, go. That's what you meant to say. <laughs> if it's lumpy, you use ice cold water to take out the lumps. Yeah. So we're gonna put some fridge water in this one. This the one to get rid of the lumps. So you can see now the lumps are gone because we put in fridge water. So that's that's how you get rid of lumps in any like sauce that you make like this. Ah, I love her. She looks beautiful and creamy. Steaming the broccoli before putting it in the oven because it won't be ready in the 20 minutes that we plan to put everything in the oven. Go a little bit slow, like five seconds. Show us what you've got underneath My there. arm is hurting. Quickly show what you have underneath there. Oh. Uh, there we go. We're back at the setting table. We're about to layer it up. I got these microwave safe baking tins because Apparently we don't have casserole dishes in this house. You don't need microwave safe, should you need oven safe? Microwave, oven, whatever, it's all one. Okay. Um, okay. Yeah, this is from Spa. They come in packs of three. Most of these are catering dishes. So yeah, if you want to go back and just, just ask. Just ask at the store. So delicious. It'll look even better when it's done. Okay. In she Please goes. Please don't burn. I don't know what I'll say to Pearl. Ooh! Delicious. So pretty. Delicious. Flavor, oh my god, it just, it's so real. Like, mm. it's really good. 10 out of 10. And I can, oh. even, 10 out of 10. I can taste the garlic, everything. It tastes the, the mixture. Oh, and I'm so hungry right now. You're, and it's so mad. good right now. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm. Mm. That's the stuff. Hey, Paul, get into it. Get it's inside us. it. Sit. <laughs> Imagine if we lived together, we'd be so fat. <laughs> Literally. Wow. We work. I can't be in. You got yeah, it. Yes, it is. You got it, ladies. Look at me. Mmm. Approved. We mm. didn't lie. We told mm. you. Ten so, out of ten. So I told y'all, niggas. Out of ten. What do we get out of ten? <laughs> I need ratings. I need people to numbers. Percentages. I ain't taking over bad. So it was a two. Wow. Everybody had like 
Pele Pele Nyana, guys. Like spicy Nyana. We'll take it. We'll take it. Please. Eight, we'll take it. 80%. She's fake. Thanks. She doesn't So, guys, try it out. Let us know how it turns out. Again, I'll link the recipe that I used for guidance, but watch the video. Remix it. Yeah. <laughs> watch the video Remixes. to get a full taste of what we actually did. Um, that's us. Winter food. Winter sessions. Cooking. So thank you all very much for watching. If you haven't already, please go watch Zaman's video on her channel. And like all the other winter sessions videos before this one. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to both our channels. Comment down below and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed this. Tell us what you guys rated out of 10. I also want to she know She doesn't... They are from seeing, appearing. Oh. But if you do make it, come back to the comments and tell us what you think. Definitely. But also, if it's not nice, like... Don't tell it us. It wasn't our that. hand yeah. that cooked it, so... In fact, don't be so clever, because it wasn't us who made it. It was you. Love you, bye!